to another week of Vineyard Kids and Youth Online. Let's start with the game. Okay, we're going to play a game called Heads Up. So Dave has on his phone a list of animals. I have to act out the animals. You have to guess what they are. Okay, so let's see how we get on. See if you can beat Dave to the answer. See how good my, put my acting skills to the test and my animal knowledge. Let's go. Okay. Uh, sloth. Rhino. <laughs> Sleep, not a sloth, a bear, hibernating, pass it. Tortoise, that was clearly uh, a tortoise. Snake? Yeah, kind of snake, yeah. <sighs> nope, pass that one. Pass that one, I don't know what they are. Uh, octopus? Squid? You're very close. Jellyfish. Yes, a jellyfish. Pass. Oh, can I get one more in? <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Chicken? <laughs> That's an excellent impression of an ostrich, clearly. <laughs> oh dear. Right. How many did we get? If you got more than me, I mean, some of them you won't be able to get, you'd have done well. But there you go. Well done. Great. We're going to be carrying on with our little book that we've been looking at, Notes from Jesus. So it's Jesus talking to us, telling us things he wants us to know. So this week, I want you to know, Jesus wants us to know, I know it's hard when you can't see me. Your other friends can come over to hang out. Well, maybe not at the moment, but normally. But me, I'm invisible. That may make it hard to remember that I'm there and that I care. But I am there. If you decide to follow me, I'm closer than any of your other friends. They might live down the road, but... Through my Holy Spirit, I live in you. And in every minute of every day, I'm at work in you and around you. When you feel moved to help someone, that's me. When you see love in the world, I'm behind that. And when you feel peace, even when things are hard, yep, that's me. I'll help you remember and believe, but you've got to do your part too. You've got to look for me, believe in me, listen for my voice, because I'm there. And the Bible verse from this one is, Blessed are those who believe without seeing me. That's John 20, 29. So our activity today is to spend some time with Jesus and a way to try and help us to, to visualise it, to picture that Jesus is with us. Might be to sit, um, however you're sitting, in a circle or wherever you are on your sofas um, and put an extra space out for Jesus. So if you're sitting on the floor, maybe put a cushion down or if you're sitting around a table, put an extra chair out um, or just put a, allocate a space on one of your sofas just to say that's for Jesus. And then let's spend a little bit of time imagining and picturing that Jesus is sat right there with you and just have a conversation with him. Tell him about your week, how you're feeling today. Tell him what you're thinking, what your worries are, what you'd love him to help you with. Just, talk, just have a chat. He loves to hear from you and he is right there with you, whether you can see him or not.
Amazing. Thank you, Jesus, that you're with us, even though we can't see you, that you're right here with us wherever we go, whatever we're doing. Mm-hmm. Great. So go off and worship now. Uh, the stuff's up on the Vineyard 53 family Facebook page. And we'll see you next time. See you next time. Bye. Bye.